Hi guys, I am Shurujit De and you are watching my YouTube channel Econometrix De. Today we are going to study class 6 mathematics. So without wasting further time, let's start the class. This could be us. So back to what I was saying. Now students, this is class 6 mathematics, okay? Chapter 15, perimeter and area, exercise 15.1. This is a continuation of this chapter. Today it is part 8, okay? And we are going to solve question number 9, okay? Those who have not watched the previous part, you can watch it. I have shared the link in the description below as well as in the i button, okay? And students try to watch the full video, okay? So that you can understand the sum nicely. Don't skip, okay? So let us come back. Question number 9. A piece of a string is 48 centimeter long. So what it is telling? First, one string is there, okay? And it is how much centimeter long? 48 centimeter. Suppose the string, if I draw the string, suppose this is the string and this is 48 centimeter long, okay? Then what they are asking, what will be the length of each side if the string is used to form a square? So, number one, you are making, using this string to make a square. That means square is like this way, okay? whose four sides are equal, okay? Now, this string, this is what? This is a string, okay? Now, this string you are using to make a square, okay? That means, from here to here, you are bending it in the form of a square. So, that means, 48 centimeter is nothing but the perimeter of the square. So, what it is telling? Perimeter here perimeter is given, perimeter of the square, they are telling. How much it is? No, 48 centimeter, okay. Here perimeter is given, previous sums, the sides were given and you were finding out the perimeter. Now, just the opposite, okay. Perimeter is given to you and you have to find out the length of each side. Now, square, I told you what is the formula of perimeter of a square, 4 into side. So, 4 into side is what? 48 centimeter. So, now from here I can get the side because 4 into, when it goes that side, it will become what? Divided by 4 centimeter. Now, you can cut 4 ones are 4, 4 ones are 4, 4 twos are 8. So, side is how much? 12 centimeter. So, this is the answer. Clear? That means, each side of the square is 12 centimeter. Clear? Now, the next one is what? An equilateral triangle, number B. Okay? This string you are using to form an equilateral triangle. So, equilateral triangle means a triangle whose three sides are equal. So, like this way, you can draw the triangle, equilateral triangle. This is what? Equilateral, equilateral triangle, okay? Now, the you are using this string only to make the equilateral triangle. So, perimeter is given, perimeter of equilateral, equilateral triangle is how much? 48 centimeter. So, the what is the formula? Three sides are equal. So, the formula is 3 into side, okay, equal to 48 centimeter. Now, only side will be how much? Side equal to 48 by 3. So, you can cut, okay, 3 ones are 3. Again, here 3 ones are 3, 1 is remainder. So, it becomes 18, 3 6 are 18, okay. Now, side is equal to 16 centimeter. And this is the answer. Clear? Now, number C. 
what they are telling ok a regular hexagon ok. So, this string you are converting in it into regular hexagon. So, let us draw a regular hexagon ok suppose like this way. So, it is almost like a regular hexagon ok whose six sides are equal ok. Now, what we will write perimeter of a regular hexagon ok and it is how much 48 centimeter clear or no. Now, what is the formula regular hexagon hexagon means what how many sides are there there is there are six sides ok. So, what is this one this picture I can name it regular hexagon ok. So, what I will write 6 into side you can write 6 into a also 6 a also ok. So, 48 centimeter now only side 48 centimeter divided by 6 you can cut 6 1 the 6 6 how much the 48 6 8 the 48 ok. So, side equal to 8 centimeter clear no? and this is the answer ok. I think all of you have understood this sum ok. So, if you like my channel then please give a like share it with your friends and do not forget to subscribe it ok and also press the all notification bell. So, that whenever I upload such videos you will get the notifications first ok. Now, let us do the next sum that is question number 10. Two sides of a triangle are 12 centimeter and 14 centimeter ok. The perimeter of the triangle is 36 centimeter what is the length of the third side. So, they are talking about a triangle. So, let us draw one triangle. So, this is a triangle and if I give the name A B C. So, if I start solving the sum the solution ok. Then I will write let A B C be a triangle ok in which two sides are told 12 centimeter and 14 centimeter in which small a I will write 12 centimeter small b I will write 14 centimeter and another side is C ok and so these two informations are given and we have to find out what C ok and C I do not know. So, this is question marks ok or what you can do ok let A B C be a triangle in which A is equal to 12 centimeter B is equal to 14 centimeter ok no need of writing C also ok. Then what it is told the perimeter of the triangle is 60 uh, 36 centimeter ok and perimeter of triangle or you can say simply perimeter is equal to 36 centimeter ok. So, these informations are given to you ok. So, let A B C be a triangle in which A is equal to 12 centimeter B is equal to 14 centimeter and perimeter is 36 centimeter. Let me write here suppose A is equal to this one is 12 centimeter B equal to this one is 14 centimeter. Now, I have to find out C I have to find out C ok. So, what I will write to find to find what C ok. So, C I have to find out. So, what I will do by the problem by the problem ok perimeter perimeter equal to how much 36 centimeter. Now, perimeter is the sum of these three sides ok. So, A plus B plus C equal to 36 centimeter. Now, A is I know 12 centimeter B I know 14 centimeter C I do not know I will write C and then 36 centimeter 
Now I will add this one 12 plus 14, 12 and 14, 26. Okay. So 2, see 2 plus 4, 6, 1 plus 1, 2. So 26 centimeter plus C equal to 36 centimeter. Then the second last step C equal to 36 centimeter minus 26 centimeter and at last C equal to what 36 minus 26 10 centimeter okay and this is the answer okay understanding or no or what you can do you can instead of writing here answer you got C so now you can write what therefore therefore the length the length of the third side, third side, the length of the third side equal to 10 centimeter and this is the answer, clear or no? So I think up to this much you have understood. You can write answer here also, no problem, okay. And you can write more nicely, you can uh, write the answer, therefore the length of the third side equal to 10 centimeter, clear or no? So, I think up to this much you have understood. You can write the answer, okay, C equal to 10 centimeter here also or you can write separately. Therefore, the length of the third side is equal to 10 centimeter, clear. So, the next sum we will do in the next part. Thank you for watching my video. Keep smiling. Bye-bye.